Well, no doubt about it, the nerves have been jangling in the last few days, but very soon the wait will be over. I'm Derek Ray, joined by Lee Dixon in the commentary box, and we're just seconds away from kickoff in what promises to be a thrilling finale. It's Sporting facing Braga. Well, Derek, it's a cup final. I love cup finals. I've played in a few in my time. Very, very lucky to do so. Won a couple, lost a couple. You don't want to lose today, that's for sure. But you have to be brave. You have to take the game by the scruff of the neck. Looking forward to both these sets of players making this an absolute cracker. Here's the lineup for Sporting. And they are a team, Lee, known for their aggressive high pressing. Well, absolutely. That takes a lot of hard work, a lot of organisation, force the opposition to make early passes. The weakness of it, if you beat the high press, you can get exposed at the back. The opposition starting 11. I'll tell you what, you don't see this formation every day of the week. No, I mean, it looks very attack-minded with the three up front. The three in midfield supply as well, but I'm a little bit worried about the three centre-backs. Will they get exposed in the wide areas? So the battle commences. Pedro Porro. Joao Mario. Spora. Palinha. Paulinho. Horta with it. Fedal on the ball. Palinha. And with it, Joao Mario. Borad. Read it magnificently and intercepted. David Carmo. Ali Musrati. Carmo. Castro. Ricardo Escaio, Busrati, Fran Sergio, room for sporting here, Joao Mario, Spora, and back with Joao Mario. He could really get at the opposition. Can he put them in front? Really important tackle. Castro. Orta with it. Here's Castro. Paulinho. And now Paulinho. Well, they keep the ball moving. Ali Musrati. Horta with it. Castro. Can't miss, surely. There it is. How about that for starters? Well, what a huge moment that might be for this club. The fans are going absolutely wild.
Well, here's the replay, and I enjoy this passage of play. It's lovely to watch. Superb passing. And then the composer is impressive as he smashes the ball with all he has to beat a forlorn goalkeeper. Brilliant strike. Well, the manager knows the importance of that goal. He also knows that you're at your most vulnerable just after you've scored. So the action continues. Let's see if Sporting can come up with an equaliser. Zuhair Fedal. Joao Mario getting in there to intercept Ali Musrati Fran Sergio they really look after the ball when they have it interception to snuff out the danger It's with Nuno Santos. Palinha. And Sporting looking creative here. Opportunity! The cut back. Crucial intervention just then amid impending danger. And no problems whatsoever for the goalkeeper. And there it is, the half-time whistle. Plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. Castro. Ricardo Orta. Carmo. Orta with it. And can they make one of these passes count? Sequeira, Galeno, Fran Sergio, and now Paulinho. Individual brilliance. Ricardo Orta, Castro, Orta with it. It looks promising. High quality defending. Joao Mario perfectly positioned to take it away. Paulinho. Mastery of the passing game. Chance to finish. Can they cover up? But it looks so threatening, but the danger averted. Substitution time it is. Busrati. How about the cross? Ali Musrati. got to be and the goalkeeper covered a lot of ground to push that away from danger well he's given a corner their referee
And firing it into the area. Not increasing the pressure. Another corner it is. Now the delivery, just unable to take advantage of that developing situation. Bruno Viana. Novice with it. And a tidy tackle. Joao Mario. Can they hit on the break? Intelligent threaded pass here. It needs an accurate cross. And can they prize them open now? Palinha. Joao Mario. Masterful piece of foiling. Ricardo Orta. The ball back with Sporting now. Bruno Tabata. And Palinha with it. Well, they might be onto something. Big opportunity. Oh, my goodness. It's drama. Heaped on drama. A late leveller. Well, they left it late, but they're back in it, Derek. You're right. Drama. Well, here's the replay, and it's a lovely through ball to set up the chance. And when he gets through to the keeper, he just smashes it past him and gives him no chance to think. A lovely finish. Well, Derek, the frustration's boiling over on the touchline. He's not happy at all with the last five or ten minutes. So a personnel change then. Even Steven won a piece on this match. Gaitan. Five minutes remaining and level here. Excellent defending. Fran Sergio. No vice with it. Fran Sergio. Joao Novais. Can they push ahead in the closing stages? Not a pass that lacks quality. Well, adding up all the stoppages, we will have two extra minutes. Oh, lovely ball. They cannot be separated here, and it's on to extra time. Otto. And so the story continues. The first period of extra time, and no one is leaving. Well, fitness levels are going to be tested now, Derek. Palinha. And with it, Joao Mario. And Palinha with it. The ball with Sebastian Coates. Still pushing for that goal that would see them forge ahead. Can he put them in front? And it's come off the keeper. And it's gone behind for the corner.
Over it comes. Well, it has come to nothing. Joao Mario. Fidal on the ball. Balinha. Fidal on the ball. Showing good defensive judgment. Half time in extra time, and still they are level. with well the second period of extra time commences what drama do we have in store for us and Sergio Horta with it. Gaetan. Fran Sergio. Chattini. Now Gaetan. Joao Novais. Gaetan. Fran Sergio. Novice with it. Gaetan. They've regained possession. And the pass, a good one. Well, they still have designs on the win. Options in the centre. It might be on for them. It's a weighted pass. And nothing positive comes of it, unfortunately. Well, a fantastic final. And it's going to end in the most nerve-shredding way possible with a penalty shootout. up with it and now it is all about the penalty shootout and the penalty converted here well that's hours of practice Derek hours of practice well he fired it straight down the center lead well you've got to shoot it somewhere eight yards by eight feet just get it in the back of the net and he squandered it off target well he looked nervous didn't he and he scores! Well, don't they look easy when they go in? Job done from the spot. Well, professional job. Well done. He's gambled on direction and won. Well, he's got his angles right there. Just look at that for goalkeeping. And then the right side of the goal line. Well, the goalkeeper's no chance with that. In it goes! Well, that's why players practice penalties in training. And he's tucked his penalty away, Lee. Well, he held his nerve. Simple as that. Well, the responsibility is on his shoulders. Failure to score, and they lose. Superbly done. How many players would try that? Well, you look stupid if you miss, but look at him now. And just like that, he's come up with the save. Well, you have to have strong hands as a goalkeeper, and look at that. It all falls on his shoulders. If he scores, they win. And now it is truly final!
One team in raptures, the other disconsolate. What an ending. Well, you can talk about the merits of penalty shootouts to decide big tournaments, big games. So much nerves of steel are needed. A little bit of a gamble here and there. Who's going to come out on top? But... Well, it's these moments, Derek, when you get your hands on the silverware and that little medal that goes round your neck might seem small now, but you'll look back at that, show your grandkids absolutely superb memories these players will have of this game. It's a special moment in the career of any footballer. And now for the trophy lift itself. The cup winners. Yeah, it's been a long, old road to get to this point. They're going to celebrate now and certainly celebrate long into the night, I think. There's always the element of chance in a cup competition. But my goodness, they've taken the rough with the smooth. And now they savour the moment. And this is really special. Getting to celebrate in front of your own fans, Lee. Well, it's giving something back. These fans have travelled all over the place following their team now they get to join in the celebrations go into the crowd and give them the cup that's what i say well then it might never find its way to the trophy evidently well all that hard work along the way in this tournament all comes together at the end when you pick the trophy up. Just look at them celebrating. A brilliant moment. Hard work indeed.